Hey there, and welcome back to Oak Street City Zoo. Welcome in the next episode, and welcome also on this wonderful Friday for a chill, relaxed weekend. Today we will have our first episode of a little revamp. Yeah, so lately we've been expanding quite dramatically, um, but now I gotta do some changes, okay? So you guys have blown it out of the park. It's just what you've created is just ridiculous lately. Um, you've You've been... Oh, well, that's not a good thing. But we have babies, though, um, which is which is which is great. Um, it's not a good thing that they've eaten that. Um, so let's put something down. But yeah, you you guys just knocked it out of the park. Um, it is incredible. Like all these blueprints you've been standing in is just ridiculous. Like really, really cool stuff. And I have to say um, that I haven't even dreamed of having that in this zoo this way but you guys just created stuff that is really really great immersive absolutely nice and just in general very cool now we will be changing a few bits and pieces here so what we're going to do um yeah i mean i have this it's it's okay can you just uh call vet let's just wait until the vet has checked that um we have a research complete all right let's check that one too Okay, do we do we have any other animal we can research at this point in time? Not like really, right? No facilities, it's all good. Um, also people were just you know noting that I need to you do you know do my um, improvement of the people again, like staff training and so on. So we just quickly do this by like clicking through and just gonna check if there are any other problems with the zoo so far. So we're just going to um, you know. Uh, just make sure that everyone is going one level up. I'm just leveling up our people here to make sure. I think money-wise, we are still doing uh, pretty decently fine. Um, we raised the ticket prices quite in, uh, enormously. We have the lion now. That should also make us a bit of money. Um, we have a good zoo rating in general. Like, I think we are on a good way of, of doing this, you know. Uh, that shouldn't be too big of... How many staff members do I even have? That is... That's just like... What the hell? I really hope that this helps because otherwise we will get bankrupt <laughs> pretty quickly. Okay, so the ostrich is about to inbreed. I think it's not because I am not allowing that. So this is a good point, actually. We are redoing this habitat over here. I'm, I'm not a big fan of this habitat anymore whatsoever. I'm not a big fan of the location anymore. It kind of blocks the entrance of the zoo. And, you know, you, you can actually see what's going on here. It's pretty hefty. Um, and what we are going to do today is we are just basically taking the exhibits a little bit further in. We're just going to do a little exhibit kind of circle over here. And then we will put like a little tortoise in the middle. So that's the basic idea, so that we just spread this whole area a little bit. But therefore, we just first of all need to get all these animals into the trade center. So that's just the first thing we are doing. Um, I just go to animals and then box all animals. Uh, oh, wait, I, I think that was a bad idea because now, well, they are all boxed. Can I also just... No, I can't. Okay, can I... Can I just... I mean, I want to box them all, but I also, okay, all, can I all, and then send them all to trade center, yes, that should be fine, and then we just do the same for them, send them all to trade center, there you go, and then we do the same for those, send them all to trade center, boom, there you go, habitat is more or less um, destroyed for the moment, so what we're going to do, um, some of the things we can actually keep, so this food thing will remain because that's something they also like the tortoise i think they also will like this one they do like the sprinkler as well so these abstract well let's just put that here whatever um so that's the first thing we're doing uh we can actually delete this barrier and we can delete that barrier too and then let's just uh delete a few more things here we don't need any more um that is part of the big building well then let's just delete this side here that we just only have these things. Uh, we still have to figure out what exactly we do with it, but I think for the moment they're fine. And then uh, I guess since we're pretty rich though at this point, in, well, we are not super rich, but we're still having a decent amount of money that I'm not worrying too much about this. So we're just gonna get rid of mostly all these things we have here. That one can go to, there you go. So that's basically all the stuff we can get rid of. Um, this one is unfortunately, I think I'm gonna keep this 
this thing here. I'm gonna keep that. Even though I want to make a connection now into this building, but it should be fine. I'm not gonna delete this bit. We can we can just reuse this somewhere else, but for the moment, I'm going to keep that like this way. What we will do though is I want to reduce this traffic over here quite dramatically. So we will now have to use um, some kind of a massive wall that does not allow people to look into the habitat so we will take like a proper wall here to hopefully make them focus a bit more on this area and then we will open up here with the pathway so what we're going to do you're just going to delete a bit of this area here just all of these things i mean that stone can remain and then we're also going to oops, I can't select that one this way. I'm just going to click it there. Okay, so that's fine. Um, the scent marker can go too. That one can go too. So, like as I said, okay, the first thing now we have to do is make sure that we just properly um, redo the pathing a little bit because, again, the entrance is absolutely not the way it should be and it's actually not a good not a good way of having that area anyhow so we're just going to try to spread the pathing in this episode quite a lot uh so we will redo the entrance area in a way hopefully that the overall traffic will be improved um now i'm gonna make sure that this is going to be like a way bigger plaza now uh so that's that's this area here um and therefore i'm just connecting this bit here. So what we are going to do, I mean, this is pretty nice. They, they, they love to stand here. So we're just going to delete exactly these things. I mean, we, we can also delete that one. It doesn't, doesn't really matter that much. And then we will just basically keep it that way. This is like a little, little lovely little gate. That uh, is quite, a, quite cool. Um, we're going to have to figure out how we make this look nice. I think I have an idea um, how we can do this. Just go in here and say brick, brick. Um, I really do hope also that we will be able to show some of you guys um, wonderful uh, blueprints you made. If, if not like dedicated for the build, I will definitely show some of the stuff off because that is... Oh, guys, you, you just make me so happy. I never thought that this project will be such a cool thing. Um, not because I, you know, not because I wasn't sure that y you guys won't deliver, but I was kind of um, worried that, you know, the the drive and the hype of it would die down so quickly that it becomes a little bit hard for me to carry on but no it's it's the opposite you guys you guys just get more and more crazy about this and that is so cool i really hope that you will continue doing that i will also ask for a few things in today's episode as well so um there will be a few things i will definitely need at the end um Right, let's keep that for a bit because that's pretty high so let's just put that over here for a sec um that should be fine. That should be all good. And now let's just see. Okay, now before we build that, we can actually also flatten that a little bit more to make even more ground for path. And you know what? I'm just going to... Yeah, that will be the shelter building. This this side here will be the shelter building. So just gonna make sure that they, they don't need that much space, the tortoise. We go for the... I think we go for the Galapagos tortoise, I guess. That should be fine. And, you know, talking of shelter, let's just see because you guys, again just delivered so much stuff. You, this is the this is one of the coolest things I've seen so far. It's made by Dommel and this is like a broken down shelter. It's nothing we will use here because that's like not the best thing to have for the um, central area here. But in general, I like this one so much because that can be like a very cool little thing for, I don't know what animal, maybe hyena or something. Oh no, we do have the hyena already. I don't know, maybe another cheeky animal, you know, that kind of could really work. I think I like this one so much that I will definitely use this now and just change it a little bit because the idea about this shelter is, is absolutely dope. Um, but I think I want to I wanna align this properly with this door, you know, that this kind of goes in here. So that's the... That's the gate. We will change this, change this building a tad bit because I definitely want to use that side having a one side glass for the people to look into so that they do not stand from this side, but actually from the other side. Um, I think this building really fits also in here quite nicely. It doesn't really block the view, but it just kind of gives a bit of a nice little feature. We can put some trees in between here. I mean, we can actually take that wall and then just build from over here, I guess. That might be nice. Um, just like following the line a little bit because I definitely want to make sure that not on both sides is open. So we're going to keep that this way. I'm just going to put a full wall in. So that is definitely what we want. And we just put another 
I think, you know what, no, we, we put the full door, yeah, that uh, full wall, actually, I should say. I'm gonna keep that going over here, and then this is going to move there. Lovely stuff here. Um, and then we're just gonna put the glass in here. I guess that's, that's nice. And all over the place, I think what I want to do, if I can, I'm not sure if that works, but let me just try that, okay? So just gonna select the upper part here. I really do hope that I... Yeah, I did somehow select that one too, but I'm just gonna deselect this and I'll let me drag that all a little bit down. So until yeah, that is the that is the perfect space. And now what we will do, we will just move this one up again, so it's kinda nice, and then I will hopefully, yeah, this is what I wanted to do. Just split that door, move it down a little bit, move it backwards, so it just kind of aligns again. Awesome. So now the whole thing is a little bit lower, you know, because I think it was a tad bit too high, you know, the ever awesome problem with Planet Zoo. And what we will do now is we are just going to open up. Wait, that was two pieces. Ah, that doesn't matter. It still looks good. Um, and then we will open up with hopefully the wall. Can I just somehow select that wall? Oh, there's a two walls. Um, that doesn't matter too much because then we're just going to take where's the half -ish thing. There you go. Um, this one here, that one here. It's gonna use like a proper pillar, I guess. So I, I'm not sure if that will be enough for the keeper to fit through. I mean, height-wise, it could. Um, it definitely should be enough for the tortoise, though. Uh, just gonna move it like so. Uh, we will get rid of that thing. We'll get rid of these things down here. So that is, you know, kind of the gate uh, to the garden, I guess. Um, and then just let's move. This uh, fair wait, I couldn't move that. Oh wait, because of the sprinkler and heater. Um, that one can go. That one can go. I don't wanna, you know, I don't wanna move this too far. But we're just gonna bring the heater back here and put another one just in that building, like what, well, whatever, like so. There you go. Uh, and then we also, we also move that sprinkler a little bit over. Hey. I mean, this can still stay, I guess, the, um, the, the fruit spike. I think they still like that, if I remember correctly. Um, they do appreciate this fruit spike um, quite a fair bit. So we're just going to make sure that this all looks a bit more smooth because, well, you know, tortoises are not really known for jumping. So <laughs> I'm not too worried about that, to be honest. I'm um, just going to line all of that a little bit nicer here. Uh, we can actually also um, just take that and then decrease the size and just like move that all a little bit more like this okay that looks a damn bit better so what we will do have this wall go here and then wait is that not like aligned why isn't it there you go and then we will just move that over like this here you go just put that like this i think they still have like plenty of space and i still want to make sure that coming in yeah, we create like multiple layers and so we can put some trees right over here. Just have a have a tree line and then we have the exhibits on the other side. That will look definitely a lot better. Okay, so what we're going to do here is we're just going to make sure that this is like going to be like the proper wall and I want this to be connected here. We still have to figure out how we make sure that these people do not... I mean, I'm, I'm gonna... Okay, so they can look in there. I want them to be looking in there from here. And I want them also to be moving away from this entrance area a little bit. So we have that, okay? And I'm, okay, so they can all be raised a little bit. So what I will do, I'm going to make sure that this is, the, I don't want them to stand here, okay? They can stand behind here, I guess, but those are forbidden for now. So I'm gonna move this all the way up until it's gone, okay? That's pretty much what I wanted. So you can have, that is fine. Maybe maybe just a tad bit lower, so it differs a bit from the background. So there you go. And they're just lowering that down ever so much. That Yeah, let's align that with the TVs, that's nice. Okay, so gotta have this done, which is, which is good. And then we smooth this out a bit more. Awesome stuff here, so that should be all good. And then I can have a look in here. We're gonna delete this because we just don't need that here. So this is kind of an area where they can stand, but you know, these animals are, holy crap, how are we getting rid of this? I mean, that is just in freaking sane. Okay, so what we are going to do here is we're just going to delete these fences 
and we are going to check that one and going to bring this just as a little connector here. Yeah, awesome, lovely stuff. Um, this one is going to be, let me just see, where is the, there's a whole bunch of education. This is intersecting, but you know what's kind of cool? We can just put that on the roof here and that is uh, a lovely little speaker. And then, yeah, we do have a whole bunch of other stuff we have to align. So for example, this is still not matching. So I'm gonna delete this um, one and two and three. So I'm going to delete that one because that's just one we need here. And then uh, what we will do now before we continue, I think I'm going to use that building anyways. And I think it's that, where's the backstage area? Is that like, yeah, it's accessible via here. We have this building there. So I'm just gonna make sure that the, the backstage access can still happen. So I guess it might be clever to just have the path laid out first. Um, there you go. So just making sure that this is all working. So that is, yeah, we can actually have a connection. Why not? Let's keep it that way. Um, and what we're going to do now is, oops, yeah, now today I really hit my microphone. like dramatically um <laughs> so uh, we are 16 minutes in i think that's a very very progressive episode so far so we are going to use um mostly I mean, just let me think for a second i guess it might make sense to use this blueprint and then just copy that blueprint over we're just going to make that work for us now so i'm gonna put this here what we need is basically, uh, yeah, no, sure. No, I mean, can I select this lower piece here? I can't really, right? Why am I not able to, give me, is that like out of this building? No, it's not. Is that like, no, it's not. Okay, this is weird. We can still leave that in if needed, but um, I wanna have it that way. It is gone and I'm not sure if I want to, like they, the backstage access can happen. They can still, access that one, but I do want to make sure that this is somewhat semi-transparent. I guess what look would look cool, I guess, if we put some glass pieces behind um, and we do have the glass pane here. I mean, um, this is like, if we double that, that should be or like triple. You can still look through somehow but it's not that it does not, uh, you know, connect well or whatnot. Um, and you can't really tell that there is the staff member behind. That's my that's my biggest threat I had. So, uh, yeah. Okay, let's see. How much can we bring that down? I'd love to bring it even more down. I'm not sure if I can connect this nicely then. Let me just quickly check if I can. I That is weird. I would love to be able to connect this normally. Can I... How and why am I not allowed to? No, I am, okay. So, let me just see. Am I now allowed to connect that nicely? Yes, I am, okay, that is good. Now let's move that exactly into position. So, it's gonna start somewhat in an angle that makes sense for later. So just like this, I guess. And then you, yeah, you, you would have like two options to view it, I guess now, from here. And now what I want to have like a half-ish can even rotate that a little bit more there you go and we have to just copy that over and now the important bit is to just create that little half ish thing here there you go just delete that bit we don't need it and just yeah no just copy that once more we do have to get a lot more rotation in here to make sure it fits with the path there you go it still does fit which i like a lot and yeah, I guess we should be able to just have that as a last one as well. It's gonna move that over. Why is it is it floating a bit? Yeah, a tad bit though. Not majorly floating, but um, yeah, yeah, yeah. It is though. Um, I mean, I should be able to raise that and just lower them all down. So if I just select all of them, they should be all good in just lowering them down ever so much so that i you know i just want i just want to make sure they're not floating that should be good i mean and if this this is going to be the connection i'm i'm not too worried about this but oh, it's a, it looks good it looks all good okay cool so that's done uh, can i just move that tree a little bit off the path there you go 
this is nice and just in order to make that all look good we will just copy the roof and make sure that this looks dope and nice but yeah for the i guess for the moment it might be better and just delete that one and get a solid brick wall it's gonna be here like that and then where's this yeah it doesn't matter we can just whatever put it uh it does matter a little bit to me so there you go so it is a little bit nicer connected and i want to have some you know just maybe maybe what on earth maybe do wait huh how and and why i mean i oh wait no no classic medium exhibit why is there no animal in there and why can i not select the the piece and the the wall the this is the this is the wall right yeah and why is the exhibit now empty uh, the, uh. okay because i'm stupid i guess so that is what we need right is that like the yeah no that's correct okay so i, I want to have like opening to both sides we'll get a few more exhibit animals now but you know before we do this let me just get this roof piece copy that from the splitter from the group i guess and then what we will do is obviously just kind of try and merge that in. We can have that a little bit lower. So we for once don't have the Z fighting or the texture fighting, if you will, for the people being awfully correct out there. I mean, you're right. It's not necessarily the Z axis. It's just any axis just kind of fighting. Um, yeah, let's just kind of try to make it as, as fitting as possible. Yeah, that's somewhat good. Uh, that will be the biggest issue here. So just gonna bring that in. There you go. That looks already a lot better. So we, let's see. Yes. Now that is what I'm talking about. That gets a lot more spread out and a lot more nice. And it will definitely look a lot more nice now when we put in all the path. So this is going to be pretty important. Um, I want to make sure that we do have a little bit of different pathing here. So. Let me just see. Okay, these are all in. Now, can we just somehow connect those here? Nah, I should have done it that way. Ah, great. How about now? Well, uh, it does it even matter too much? Because I figure this... I think it might not matter too much, though, because they don't even need to connect, right? I think it would be important to connect for the staff members, but as I think they might not even... Oh, well, I mean, whatever, just going to connect that. Um, just smooth that out and then we will hopefully be able to, yeah, just connect it that way. It almost looks like a little bit of a plather. We put a plant there and that should be fine. Right, this is something I'm going to tackle. Nah, let's take maybe wood as if this is like a little, ah, ah, uh, uh, uh. I, <laughs> sorry, uh, well, <laughs> There you go. This is uh, kind of the like if I do it that way, we will get this right. Yeah, lovely. Okay, so I want to make sure that this is some kind of cool little resting place here. Uh, I think we just keep that open and then we will do a little trick here to just make sure that this stays the way it is. Um, gonna put, I, I was about to say I can't, but I can. Okay, that's nice. So just smooth that out and then just increase the size here. No, that is the. That's the best size we have. I I think it's because of the water again, right? On this side. It's gonna we can't connect here because the water, right? Is that the the big issue? Obstructed by water volume. Okay, so what we need to do is box the animals, do the water. Okay, I, I think that should be quickly done. Uh that's not the that's not the hobby. Holy crap. Where's the entrance again? Oh, that's somewhere hidden in here. Yeah, there you go. Entrance now. Let's go to animals, box all animals, pause. So everyone is boxed, nice. Can I just redo? Ah, yeah, well, I still can't put the water back in, but I hope that it was only this water volume. Just, yeah, I was about to say, let's pray, but yeah, well, it just, it just was that one. So we're going to just do it that way. We can't really smooth it out too much, but that's fine. We need this area still. That's kind of cool. And now let's put the water back in. Awesome. And then we can already go back in and say, unbox all animals. Just quickly 
Bloop, do this. All right, great. Cool. Okay, the major work hopefully has been done here. So what I will do is now try to... Yeah, this is exactly what I want. I wanted to guide the stuff a little bit nicer this way. So, okay, so the question now is how can we... I think we can just only do it that way. Yeah, right. Okay, so this is this is kind of kind of exactly how I wanted it to. Um, the main question is how... How would I be able to... Like, the thing is, I want to make sure that we have, like, a very proper connection here. So, somewhat like that. And then, yeah, so we do have that bit of connection. And my, my biggest issue here is, like, I want to... Can I somehow... I can't really. I want to make sure that, yeah, this is exactly what I meant. So that, yeah, 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 that's, that's great. So they can't, like, if I... Yeah, no, that's fine. They will be able to bug in there like a little bit, but it just doesn't matter. I'm gonna put some bins or benches in here so they won't do that. Um, yeah, no, that's great. And now we will connect this path over here as well. Uh, if it, it will let me. There you go. Awesome. Cool, look at that. And then can I can I just lower size wise? It doesn't matter, right? We okay, we just keep that. It doesn't it doesn't really matter at all. Um, the only thing is, yeah, that looks a bit nicer. And we just could make that all smoothy smooth out even more. Great, that looks that looks that looks actually sexy. And now um, the last thing we're just doing is uh, connecting all the little bits and pieces here and there. So we're just going to go down and just do this because yeah, that's def definitely needed. Um, you know, just gonna. I'm I'm not sure which pathway I want to have here. Like, I don't want to make too many different ones here, but I still want to get some variation in. Yeah, why not have some some solid path here? That is, that, I think that's nice. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. And then you just put some flowers and stuff in that should go. I mean, we can also put like a kiosk here if we want to just have some more options. Not only there, you know, just making people happy by having some more food and whatnot. Um, but now the next little trick we have is like putting a queue connection here and another connector here and obviously we're just going to take this one awesome see that it kind of keeps that roundish ish thing i'm not even sure if we could smooth that bit yeah see then this happens and we don't want that so we're just going to keep it this way it looks a bit weird but i think it's fine now um let's quickly because otherwise i will definitely forget um quickly put some benches bins and stuff like that down um, just to make sure that this is all nice and tidy and, you know, just having that little bit. I'm gonna put a tree in the middle, so therefore let's just have a bin here already. So that's where the... Actually, no, we're just gonna take that one. So that's where the... That's where the tree will be. Um, same... Same goes here and there. Just gonna have some trees in the middle to make it look a bit more park-ish, if you want. Uh, and then definitely, uh, I guess, talking of park-ish, I... I'd love to have some seating opportunities. I'm not sure if they would take them um, because of that area. But I still would love to have some. Uh, let's just put some along that line here. Yeah, I'm not sure if that's all we need, but you know, just putting some to the sides. Oh, no, actually, you know what? We would just put them here. That could also block them from going there. I guess that would be... Yeah, that's, that's kind of what we want. And then we just put some, one more there, yeah. So kind of a little bit of seating area. It's not like crazy, but I think it, it fulfills the job and that's nice. Awesome, okay, let's quickly, we like 28 minutes in, still very decent, I guess. So what we're we going to do, um, obviously that is wrong. Uh, we're gonna have to, wait, how on earth? Okay, so first of all, that's gonna be deleted. And then we are just going to delete all of that until here, I guess. So let's continue by doing that and then just like so. I mean, I mean, I'm just going to, just going to make that a little bit here very nice. And then we definitely have to make sure that this goes exactly here. And then we're just going to bring that here. Oops. And just make sure that this one goes there and this one goes to the side awesome and we're just gonna follow follow the sun 
Sync counter, there you go. Okay, so that's in. This this bit doesn't matter. They can't even bug through there anyways. Okay, so let's go to barrier. It's like that one. One side glass does not work. Okay, so I'm just going to pull that back a little. And same for that side here. One side glass. It, one side glass. It's two. Are you kidding me? But now. Ah, okay. I was about to say it doesn't work, but it, it does work. Okay, so... That's definitely the side we're gonna go for and we do have this little slight issue here that we now have to just yeah that is about it and then uh, 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 <laughs> yeah I guess so and then yeah I mean the can I just have it yeah and then just pull yeah it's it's just to make sure that they don't uh, you know, the problem about here is they, if they go here, that's technically escaped. So I will put some, I will put some stones in there just to make sure that they don't escape technically, I guess. Yeah, no, I was about to say that this doesn't work either then. Gnarf. Um, what is that? Like, can I, yeah, I can. Awesome. So you're going to put this way. Lovely stuff here. But yeah, no, this is something we needed to do anyway. So I'm just going to pull that one in. A bit more like this great and on that side we're just going to lean that inwards a tad bit more as well there you go let's hit barriers again no wait i need to <sighs> they will definitely go there just because they can i mean it doesn't matter but yeah you know what we do just before we do anything else just gonna pull these things in. Uh, 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 where is it? Oh, wait, no, that's a, that's a big one. That's a big one. So I'm gonna put this, I know that the tortoises are very weird on, on stones anyway, so I think it does even do the job if we just pull them in like this. And is it like even a smaller one? Yeah, let's pull that, yeah. I think that should be fine. That should actually prevent them already from going there. Um, and now we, we've done that. Mm. We have to make sure that we will get these animals. So first of all, let's get some exhibit animals, okay? Shall we? Now I want to have some cool. You know, we definitely have some. We definitely have some uh, snakes here. So that one looks fine to me. That one looks fine too. Longevity is kind of another thing because they will make so many babies. I don't really like. I, I, I hope as well. Um, and then we will have the Brazilian wandering spider. The wandering, wandering, wandering spider. Um, shall we have, okay, scorpions. We had them all over the time. I think, I think we never really had the Goliath beetle. It's just males available. Goliath frog is also kind of nice. We do have the iguana. We don't have the Lehman's poison frog and we didn't have that either. So that one is cool, but we will definitely go for the Mexican Tarant uh, red is that the knee bulb tarantula yeah okay gotta have that one in here as well and the last one is going to be the titan beetle yes indeed yeah fatality is zero no that's not good that's good that's good okay so we do have our animals now um and we just kind of bring them in easily so let's just select the titan beetle goes here and then we have the brazilian friend goes there and then we have uh, two spideries that go here and then the boas go there. All right, now let's have a little look um, at which which is the... Okay, that is all good. We have to do all the habitats. I mean, that's kind of sure. We do have the keeper every month. Who is the... Uh, okay, so this is... Which, which, which uh, work zone is that in? work zone um this should be the lemur island and iguanas okay we're gonna have to edit that one and this is going to have that 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 and that is well in lemur island and exhibits there you go i'm not sure if we need to employ a second one but as of now they are in these should be the animals yeah well what is what what is your big deal here social group too few adults and jewel wait how and why are they all boxed? Why are you all boxed though? And why are there so? That is a crazy little box. Um, unbox all animals. Booyah. How many animals are in here? Not that many though. Well, four, three, two. That should be all good. 
Okay. Box is not in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Blah, 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 blah. I'm about to do this. Just chill down, game. Like, give me those few seconds, okay? So do we have anything for the layout already? No. So that's, that's an animal we definitely have to uh, research. So let's just put that little bit up here. Awesome. So that should go. Um, that one has to be put up as well a little bit. And humidity can be all the way up. Uh, still no. Okay, that's interesting. So another thing to research. Um, your layout is definitely going to be improved. Uh, and a tropical plant, I like that plant too. And then you get this tad bit more temperature and the humidity as well. And then what about, ooh, you are not doing good whatsoever. So first of all, you get all these locks and stuff. You get the heat lamps, whatever. And then that is good, but like, that is not good. Okay, let's hit unpause the game and see if if we match it. That is great. We did match it. So that is also great. Okay, so what about you? Awesome, we did hit it as well. Sweet, same for that one, and uh, same for that one. Awesome. Okay, before we hit, have it has become invalid. Oh, well, uh, it's not a good one. What about the animals in the habitat? They're still existing, which is good. Um, you yeah, know, I mean, that's not a big deal whatsoever because I think yeah, the the one, the one thing we we okay. So where's the that's already the habitat barrier, right? That should already be it. Is that better now? Yeah. Okay, let's call that gorilla again. I'm not sure if that is still in the work zone because when it became uh, blah blah edit. Is that in? Yeah, we're just gonna put that in as well. Gorilla. Yeah, that is good. Just fix it. Just to make sure that we don't break anything, you know? It's kind of kind of important. Uh, let's go to animal trading. And then, uh, do we have tortoises though? I think we don't. I'm quite sure we don't. I'm not sure what we will do with the other animals. We we will relocate them at some point, maybe in the next episode. I'm not too sure though. Um, so let's go to the G, Galapagos. Uh, Galapagos, Galapagos, where is that one? Or Galapagos, giant tortoise, there you go. Lovely stuff, look at how many great ones are on here. So I'm just gonna adapt that one. Lovely, and then you know, just gonna, yeah, 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 yeah. Raul, 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 <laughs> Raul. Okay, never mind. Um, where are you guys? Where are you? I didn't see you here, so that is going to be in here too. Awesome. Wait, uh, just deliver. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Deliver, and then where's the other one? Wait, which one? Okay, I did deliver Aitana, and now it's the. Raul case. Great. So that's the moment where we can hit play. So that should be all good. Animal has eaten guests. Yeah, we still have that. I mean, what shall I do? This is, you need a workshop. How, okay, this cannot be reached. Good, good note though. So that means we have to change this a little bit. So let's, let's see if that help. No, it, it can't help. So we just have to delete this and then, mm, I'm not sure if that is the Thing. Just gonna raise all of that here. Boom. And it should be good now. Yeah, that's that's fixed at least one issue. And what about now? Can I still move through here? Let's have a look. I mean, if that would be, uh, it still looks better, I guess. Yeah, it seems not to be big of a deal. They still seem to be able to go out here. Um, low welfare, low welfare. Yeah, we're gonna take care of that now. Um, so both both are in. Like, why do you have low welfare? Oh wait, I didn't click on you, did I? No, I didn't. Okay, so social, sp wait, you, are you telling me that? Holy crap, wait, redo it. Oh yeah, well, let's just keep that, it's fine, I guess. Oh, look at that, I can even go onto this little thing, I love that. Um, Plant-wise, they're good. Um, I, I wanna have some stuff in here, but still, uh, let's just, do this real quick, like terrain wise, they need some more sand. I like sand. Finally, someone who, who appreciates some good sand here. Just, you know, just give them, give them sandy sand, sand. Just gonna put some more down here, lovely stuff. And then, um, enrichment, what are you missing on? Species toy. Okay, well, that, that should be not too big of a deal. Let's say, um, Galapa G, Jalapa G. Jalapaji, and then we just go to toys. What do we still? Oh wait, we could have had a scent marker. You know what 
you know what what we do if it doesn't matter why doesn't it work i would have loved to put that just on there but it doesn't allow me i'm just gonna put that here and you know what because i like you just get that ball too just play with the ball i love it i love it okay cool that's done now my, my only question is do we still have a, a work zone available for you now this should be the um mixed habitat entrance edit this work zone it still has that one in that's pretty interesting though okay well let's let's keep it that way why not okay so that is good we only have this time okay how can i solve this last me yeah i know oh, 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 oh wait i haven't seen that in a while can you see hey no 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 keep fighting keep killing you whatever just no and don't bug into each other i mean sorry but this is not what you should do you should play i love to see you guys play with each other and i, I want to you know see at some point a baby playing with the mama that would be i haven't seen that in such oh my god the disco tigers are back okay <laughs> you were cheering right okay never mind then oh there's like a weird bug just landed on me sorry just needed to quickly the oh look at that west line uh, america well west african line is about expecting offspring anyways we're doing good um we're doing really good guys um okay i'm going to do a tad little cut here just to end this episode in style i'm just going to do all the nifty bits here we need uh, just do some you know all the all the right stuff and i'm going to catch you in the next second when we are just doing the outro okay give me a sec all right we are back and you can see that I did mostly all of the stuff that was needed over here. So um, I think really this was a very nice overhaul of this entrance area. It almost um, completes this city look a lot more. And yeah, we still haven't we still haven't really made sure that this area is less cramped. Um, there are some little issues here still about this area, which uh, I guess are mostly down to this little bottleneck down here. Uh, I I'm, okay, I think because of water, we won't be able to really fix that quite simply. Um, I'm, I'm thinking of maybe doing a little connection over here, which doesn't work for whatever reason. Um, so what about just... Uh, it doesn't really work because of the water volume still. I think, you know, the only way to make sure that this works is kind of getting rid of, of any of these connections, whether it's going to be this one or this one. Um, but overall, I think... We made a good job in, you know, at least... Oh, tickets are underpriced. Well, that is something I'm taking. Uh, let's just go all the way up to 42. And 32, 4, 3, I don't know. Um, low welfare. What, what, what's your issue? Social. Stress. Stress is your issue. Okay. Okay. Well, that's still the same. I got this. But how how is stress your issue? And, and why? Is it so many people being over here? Are they too loud? Is this like... In heat, oh well, that is increasing the heat a little, uh, the the stress level, I guess, of them. Um, because when they're inside, they they do have the stress, I guess. Uh, I think you know the the easiest way of kind of uh, counteracting that is uh, by security security putting down here a you know do not disturb sign here, a lovely thing, and just hoping that this helps. You know that them um, them being a little bit quieter. I'm just gonna put another one just in here so in case they haven't seen it there they do see it there just gonna put another one here and just all over the place here as well awesome look at that guys this zoo is becoming incredible um it is really nuts okay so that fixed it we, i still need a workshop i don't care you know curly hair don't care whatever yeah i, I, I just could put that down here just to have one and then this, yeah, finally that notification is gone. I don't, you know, I don't, I don't mind this too much, but just whatever. Um, it's still, I mean, how do I, is this because I don't have a quarantine or whatever? I mean, last meal quality, social. What is the social welfare though? Social group space. Oh, is it because of, um, I mean, the overall welfare is still okay, but is that because now there are more in this area? Oh, that's right. They are actually having some issues. I mean, you know, it's only like for a matter of time now. As long as the, as long as the tigers live, um, the babies with them, that's that's the issue. But you know, I think we can we can just definitely just keep it the way it is because well, you know, they are not there forever. You know, but look at that. It it seems to be 
getting a little bit better here. Just I love a lot. I just look at look at this new area, guys, with all the layers in here. I mean, I am a big freaking fan of that. Look at look at this overhaul. You know what we quickly do? As long as they don't complain, I will change this to a normal wall. Just because it looks better for the zoo. Um, because we just look from that side, you know what I mean? I, I, I just don't know if that is the thing or whatnot, but I, I think, yeah, overall that's a good idea. But just look at this awesome new area. It is, it's like 100% in your face city zoo. I, I think that is so cool with all the little bits and layers and stuff. And that is like only in like a quarter of an hour. Which I, I still believe is, is kind of ridiculous, but I mean, look, look at, okay, so, okay, you know, I don't want to be too proud of myself here, but that just changed the whole character of the zoo dramatically. It changes also the, the guest flow. How many guests though we do have? Three and a half thousand nearly. Uh, so yeah, quite a lot. Spotted hyena has uh, matured. Do they fight each other? I mean, we will see that in a bit. What is, what is going on here? Low welfare. Oh, well, because they, too quick. Too quick, gonna solve that in the next bit. I paused the game. Guys, that's that's been it. It was a pleasure again. I really hope you enjoyed today's episode a lot. I certainly did enjoy this a lot. And I really hope you guys are gonna have a wonderful weekend. I'm not sure how much material I can give you. I'm a little bit uh, behind my schedule, which is due to my work situation at the moment, which is a good thing, you know, a lot to do means a good, good kind of time and, you know, not having a boring period anymore. Uh, but anyways, that also means less work for YouTube, which, is again not my main thing so that, that's why anyhow um i really hope uh, that you guys are uh, also having some good plans and also you know i'm gonna catch you in the next one until then have a good time and i'll see you goodbye thank you for watching this video i really do appreciate it i really hope you enjoyed it and um yeah i was really happy to have you here in case you enjoyed it and you haven't subscribed yet make sure to consider subscribing you can do it via this button here and if you want to see more uh, there's some cool other stuff linked here for you this is suggested for you personally that's pretty cool and in case you want to support the channel a tiny bit more you can do it via this wonderful hype camel link over here i really would appreciate it. and also big thank you already to all the people who do already support the channel really do appreciate that but now have a wonderful time guys and I catch you in the next one.